adventure for us at Seaborn is being able to allow our guests to experience something unique, something that is bringing them closer to the destination, to the wildlife they're seeing, but in a very safe and controlled manner. Traditionally, small expedition ships were these really rough, bare to the bones kind of ships, bunk beds, shared bathrooms. That changed. Guests no longer need to make a compromise. We took two years to build out our Alaska itinerary with ventures in mind. We do go the traditional ports of Ketchikan and Sitka and Juneau, but we also wanted to take the Seaborne ship to kind of more remote places that maybe our Seaborne guests hadn't been to before. These ships are built like yachts, and when I first joined Seaborne, I was quite blown away by the amount of deck space that we have. I haven't sailed on any other cruise ship that has had so much space per guest. When I walk around the ship, it's difficult to believe that we have 450 guests on board. It's just incredible. We get to go into places that a lot of ships don't get to go into due to our size and the length of our itineraries. We go up to a glacial lake. The mountains come rising up right out of the water. Pictures just don't really do it justice. I've had several kayakers indicate that it's probably the most exciting, special experience they've had in their lives. We take you to what people want to experience as opposed to you know, what most people experience. This is Alaska everyone comes to see, but very few people do. So same thing, we're just gonna come straight up and over into the boat. There we go, it's a dusky, good. Straight up. This is a, again, a pelagic fish. Uh, we avoid the spines yeah. and stuff on all of them. Our biggest goal out of this is to kind of give the entire Alaskan experience. They're gonna go out and they're gonna catch their fish, they're gonna come back here and we're gonna clean their fish and we're gonna actually feed them their fish. It's great to have the Ventures team on. That's what makes the experience for our guests different. They bring on experts that are just amazing. It's really an in-house boutique kind of service. Tonight you might have dinner, for example, with Luki, our ornithologist. The following day you're joining for a lecture about birds in the north. It really gives our guests the opportunity to experience destinations and make them come alive with a team of naturalists that are around them all the time, pointing things out, and it just brings a lot more to their onboard experience. Our guests book a Seaborn cruise for that intimacy. They know that they're not a number on board, that they're going to get personalized service. It's that human element that we provide, that connection between our crew and our guests that I think is the secret ingredient. We make the guests feel like they're coming home again. We make them feel comfortable as soon as they walk up the gangway. It's really rewarding to me to be able to work for Seaborn, to work with guests, to be able to share the knowledge that we've gained over the years and see the light up on their face when they discover something they didn't know. It's an exceptional feeling.